Hello everyone, thanks for stopping by Spirit and Me, 1111. <laughs> it's your girl Stardust, 1111. I didn't expect my clicker to actually work and start the camera when it did, but uh, all the better for me. I don't have to get up or call my five-year-old son in here to start my camera. <laughs> Putting me on some lavender oil. This always sets the mood and tone just right for me. It's like meditation in a bottle. Check out the website, www.spiritinme1111.com if you want to pick up some of that. I do all kinds of little essential oils. And uh, it's really, really good for manifestation and so on and so forth. So, hmm, looking for a regular tarot deck. Here we go. <laughs> this reading is going to be for the sign of Capricorn for December 2019. I don't know if I did a Capricorn for last month. One of my subscribers commented on a video that I forgot Capricorn. And indeed, I'm sure I did. I was waiting for you guys that um, knew that your sign was missing for that time period to comment and leave me a message. And at that time, I would um, go ahead and put you guys on a list to be um, to get you a recording out there just moving and everything so i did miss a few of you guys for i think it was maybe a two-week window so it is what it is if you guys hit me up if i missed your sign for that time i'll check that and if that is the case i'll definitely get you a video out there and upload it within the week okay so capricorn is an earth sign this reading could also resonate for the taurus or virgo as well as earth is our element i am a virgo sun sign but i resonate so much more with my pisces moon and midheaven i love my pisces energy it's so amazing okay so this reading is going to be gender neutral as always my readings are always all gender neutral so you can do whatever it is that you need to do with those genders um, assign them reverse them whatever you need to do to better fit your situation and tarot is time that things can be events that have already happened that are currently taking place or that will be unfolded for some of you capricorns here in the near future i'm working with my drumbo <laughs> tarot deck so this one is not as easily shuffled as the rest but i haven't used these guys in a while and i absolutely adore them why not use them we got two Woo! Venus and Virgo and the Page of Pentacles. That's the Page of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. Your energy is popping. That is Spirit's way of letting me know it's time to stop the shuffle and get right into your reading. Capricorns, so those cards will be at the bottom. I'm going to base and build your spread around these guys right here. You got the Page of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. So your person, your situation, something here is... Um, you have news coming your way good news um and it's about a pentacle so it's this earth energy virgo taurus capricorn again your person could be bringing you a solid offer this person that you're thinking about that's on your mind is probably in another page wow okay i like it capricorn so with the page of pentacles here this is pentacles well pages are messengers so this page of pentacles is bringing you a message of um, a level up of some sort. Some of you are waiting for a job. Some of you, um, with this page, I'm thinking like your person wants to offer you something solid. This guy is holding this pentacle and is looking at this pentacle, is admiring this pentacle, um, handling with care, like special delivery, making sure this message makes it to you and is being very delicate in the delivery of this message. So this person is coming genuine with this offer. It's very solid. You could be dealing with a younger person here as well. Capricorn, someone a little bit younger than you, but very serious um, about this situation. Solid, trustworthy, great grounded, stable, working on themselves. This is someone who is going to be really, really good uh, moving forward with finances, someone you can invest in and trust with that pentacle type of energy. Your person sees you as the nine of pentacles. So your person wants to add value to you, wants to come your way and let you know that they see your shine. They see your glow up. They see your hard work. The nine of pentacles is about hard work, being single, independent, and just really hard working, paying attention to yourself. This is the ultimate self-care card in the deck next to the Queen of Cups, which you have here. We'll get to that. <laughs> so sexy, single, independent, the Nine of Pentacles here, this person is focused on their money, on their coins, okay? So like you are just in a place right now where you're working really, really hard. You're being noticed. People, it's something about you. 
um, Capricorn, your energy, the way you show up in life, the way you dress, the way you carry yourself, how determined, hardworking, and dedicated you are. And your person is looking at you for that, seeing you as that delicate pentacle, wanting to come in with that solid offer, wanting to let you know that they're trying to match your fly. They're trying to come and be where you are right now in that nine of pentacles type of energy but like i said with this page of pentacles this is a younger person and someone who probably is going to need a little help and guidance along that way and you could also at this point in your life be needing help and guidance with um those pentacles right now in your life being that you do possess that nine of pentacles energy it doesn't mean that you don't struggle I mean, it doesn't mean that you don't spend recklessly or out of control. It just means that you're really, really good at securing the bag. You do that very well. That's what you do. Um, it's like a natural, you know, reflex to you just as natural as breathing. You know, you get it. You get to it and get it done. You're a go-getter. You're very ambitious. You're secure the bag. And your person sees that in you, Capricorn. <laughs> so the Empress here. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. The Empress is, um, this is probably someone who um, is married, a married person, or this could be someone that you or your person has kids with or your person. Uh, it could just be your energy. So the Empress embodies all of the queens. She is the queen of all queens. This person is a, someone that gives birth to new strength, new ideas. You're pregnant with a lot of ideas, Capricorn. You have a lot of ideas in you. You have abundance written all over you. You have an abundant mindset. So you attract abundant opportunities to yourself, which always puts you in that nine of pentacles type of seat, type of energy. And for the most part, what I just got here, that you are single most of the time. You don't even have to be single right now at this time of your reading, but you do find yourself single a lot because most of the time you're getting this bag, you're securing this bag. Then there's always someone young and immature there. They may show up with their pentacles. They may show up with an offer to give you something but at the end of the day you're left holding and secure in the bag because this person is young and mature in their own energy and always falls back from what they initially started out with so that's keeping you single it's keeping you in your energy but you bounce back you know like you bounce back to your empress game you know you always get on your shit you may fall but you get right back up and get back to it you about your bread damn that's what's up capricorn <laughs> So we have Queen of Cups here. Um, this is, oh my bad. With the Empress here, you can be dealing with a Libra or a Taurus, okay? All right, so yeah. Going into the Queen of Cups here, we got Queens all over this. Empress, the Queen of Nine of Pentacles. Capricorn, some of you guys are just doing it. The Capricorn is about money and Capricorns are very hard workers and dedicated. That's Earth energy. That's being about that money. So damn, that's what's up. It's in the charts for you. Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, energy, water, energy, very loving, kind, caring, nurturing, supportive, wearing your heart on your sleeve. And you show up in your reading to say that you're very hardworking, dedicated, committed. You invest into others emotionally, Capricorn, more than they invest into you. And at the end of the day, again, it leaves you single. That puts you in the place that you are always finding yourself back where you started at. Single, independent, but you are always about your money. You always about securing it. Even when you fall short of those pentacles, even when your nine gets knocked back down to that page of pentacles, when you just got to start back over scratch and start over and you back with that one pentacle, you always build your way back up to nine because that's your element. That's what you do. Okay. Hmm. Queen of Cups, this um, someone that um, has a knack for working in healthcare. You could be working in um, healthcare, be it physical or mental health. You're working somewhere where you are caring for the needs and wellness of others because that's what that water energy is about, right? So you're very caring, very nurturing. Some of you are um, with the Page of Pentacles here, looking to level up um, your career, looking to go better places, places that is going to help you grow those pentacles here. Uh, very secure at work, um, or you are very good at keeping and maintaining the job and work and for the most part it's going to be um around health care for some of you uh, this is a younger person with the page of pentacles right next to the nine of pentacles um a lot of you capricorns that are watching this is for someone younger here what i'm getting a lot of you below 30s um 
under 30s here with the page and the nine next to each other it doesn't mean that there's not older ones there it's not for everyone it's very general but the energy i'm getting for this spread right now is what it's telling me your empress here is that um, you could be dealing with a younger person that you have kids by or that has a baby's mom somewhere in the picture and this person this message is getting to me because there's so much coming out about this reading so this what i'm getting from this is that your younger person that you seem to have a knack for dealing with these younger guys that ain't got all their shit together right so then you're the empress they always see you as the empress because you always bounce back no matter what happens how they knock you off how they knock you down emotionally that you're very loving so you put a lot of time trust and effort into people and relationships and they don't give back Okay, um, two of swords, air energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, there's a choice to be made. This is um, like stalemate energy, like there's a choice to be made. You know what choice will be to, to make moving forward to better yourself in your life. You need to cut somebody out. But right now, you seem to have the blinders on to that whole situation. Like you just don't give a, a fuck about it one way or the other. What could this mean? This could be someone dealing with a baby's father somewhere who you are very in love with king queen of cups or king vice versa whatever you need to do with those energies and it's like you need to make a choice to cut this person off you need to make a choice of what you're going to do with you for yourself moving forward because this person can always put you in a position that you're losing it is what it is some people don't want to hear that shit, but you know it is what it is when you cut the nine of pentacles next to the page you got somebody very young very green very early in life very early in their career taking on new challenges like the scholar willing to get up get out and do something always wanting to and that's low energy as far as um where you're coming from financially with your finances so you may not have a lot but what's possible for you is the nine of pentacles um being made self-employment leveling up getting the bag securing the bag going from that page stepping into that nine of pentacles energy getting your grown ass woman on right and going right into the imprints giving birth to new ideas new strength being the queen of all queen your person sees you as somebody that gets to it um <laughs> and your person wants to come to you with an apology page of cups water energy cancer scorpio pisces so someone somewhere wants to apologize for a situation that has you stuck right now at a stalemate energy because you don't know what to do next or what decision to make the universe is saying make the decision um, sooner than later so it doesn't keep knocking you off your square keep putting you back at square one where you started where you keep finding yourself back at the beginning where it all started mentally anyway um emotionally with the queen of cups anyway you keep getting emotional setbacks with dealing with a person um paid going backwards from the queen from the empress it's going backwards you're reading it's like someone from your past the six of cups is not here but this is what i'm channeling someone from your past keeps knocking you off your square you keep allowing someone to keep coming in and knock you off your shit and it could be someone that you have kids with or that you are married to being the empress energy here so it is what it is knight of pentacles right another person that's a court card so someone again wants to come with an offer the knight of pentacles is the slowest moving knight in the deck this person is bringing an offer to you as very solid, very grounded. Um, this person is very strategic, um, is crossing their T's, dotting their I's. Very, very strategic here with this Knight of Pentacles type of energy. This could even be your energy, Capricorn, that you're very strategic in your planning and your moves. Doesn't matter what's going on. Doesn't matter that you keep allowing your heart to get you in these fucked up situations that's like hitting a reset button and then you're sitting back wondering why me why this shit again how did i get here again you're always planning your next move and you plan very carefully and you prevail for the most part because you are the imprints here and the nine of pentacles and the queen of cups and you're very loving but you always bounce back you always get back on your feet and manifest your coin moving forward Woo. okay so hmm, trying to think what oracle no i want a spirit animal card for this I'm feeling like pulling you guys a spirit animal oracle card for this. So that's what's up, Capricorn. <laughs> 
Some of you are going to be pregnant with the Empress and the Queen of Cups right next to each other. Your person wants to get you pregnant. You got somebody coming your way. Uh, when you sleep with this person, make sure you wear a condom because they're either going to try to get you pregnant or they want to get you pregnant or somebody you have kids with. This could be someone that you're dealing with, a baby mom um, situation where they have someone pregnant somewhere else. You know, I'm just getting that energy here. I'm just getting the channeling for that here. But you know, it's like at the end of the day, it may hurt you. You may be stuck. You may not know what to do or really how to cut this person off moving forward. But you are the Empress and the Nine of Pentacles. So you are on your shit. This person doesn't want to let you go. And it's always coming back apologizing. This person's always in a position where they're apologizing. <laughs> where they're apologizing. And you're like, you know what? Every time it just puts you in a position where you go into it with a whole new energy you're strategically planning your next move how to come out of it how to get on top but you're just mainly focused on your money at the end of the day this one flip i will take it for you lion higher calling so that's your animal spirit card here capricorn you have within you all the courage you need let go of the past and reclaim your majesty you will find success and contentment with those by your side make noble choices for your life and your tribe <laughs> Imprints, so do what you need to do for you and your kids. Make that choice with that two of swords type of energy. Your tribe is your kids. Your vibe attracts your tribe. So stop dealing with these people that's causing these low vibrations in your life. Moving forward and do what you need to do for you. Go for the gusto, but don't never let anyone take you off your square that you find yourself back in that page of pentacles type of energy, you know. So that's what's up. I'm like, yeah. Your spread here is different. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Every spread is different, but sometimes these energies just send me for a loop. And I'll be figuring it out as the cards come out. And I do get some readings where I just can't stop pulling cards. But uh, <laughs> I'm going to get you guys a reading out here. Spirit, do we have anything else? Well, the energy oracle for Capricorn. Let's get these guys an energy oracle and send them some clarifiers. I don't know. If I'm going to clarify, if I'm going to extend this reading over on Vimeo, the last couple ones I have not, um, just because, you know, it's such a good reading, there's no need to. I've been doing longer readings now here in my new location. I'm like, my energy is just really different here. So that's what's up. I'm able to give you better, more clear, you know, guidance with my tarot, and I feel good about them. So I just leave it there for the most part. So you guys can contact me for that personal private reading if you were meeting it www.spiritofme1111.com go over there shop for some of my candles again my oils and um you know book me book me guys so energy oracle for the capricorn december 2019 the thinking man <laughs> i'm gonna get the book for that one the thinking man that's card number 46 for you guys there we go male of wisdom or understanding this card shows a man standing before an archway. Let's get this right here. I don't know, you guys may have to zoom in for this the way my camera's angled. I can do nothing from where I'm sitting, sorry. Okay, this card shows a man standing before an archway gazing at a crystal in his hand. He is a thoughtful and reflective man representing the potential presence of a teacher in your life now or about to arrive soon. This person may be there to educate you in finer details of your chosen direction, or there may be, or may be there to assist you in some specific spiritual, mental, or emotional pursuits. This card is telling you to pay attention, for this could lead to great strides in personal or professional growth. Going from the Nine of Pentacles to the Empress, Queen of All Queens, keep that in mind, Capricorn. This man may also be a love interest coming your way, or perhaps just a new male friend. Knife of Pentacles, someone's coming in, baby, with that love offer. Wants to offer you something solid, stable, grounded, financially secure, working on his bag as well as you working on yours. It's going to match your fly, Capricorn. All right? Okay. But be on the lookout for this guy in the physical world and be open to his information. Learn what you can. A new discipline, technique, course of study, or healing practice could change your life forever. The scholar, Page of Pentacles, always looking to learn, always wanting to take on new challenges and adventures. Ooh, I love how these oracles just bam, bounce right off the tarot from my readings. It'd be so amazing. <laughs> so I'm going to clarify some of this spirit, if you will. Let's get clarifying for the Capricorns for their December 2019 reading. All right, let's get clarifying here. What do we have? Let's, I don't know. Uh, 
Two of Swords. I don't really call my cards off, but I'm gonna clarify. Like whatever spirit puts out there, I rock with it. So it is what it is. <laughs> don't forget, guys, hit that like, share, and subscribe button, and that bell notification if you'd like to be notified the next time your girl uploads some content over here to my channel. I would sure appreciate it. Okay, spirit, let's get rocking now for the Capricorns for their December 2019 reading. Do you have any messages for Capricorn? What messages do we have for the Capricorn for their December 2019 reading? Ooh. Oh, wow. Ace of Pentacles. Ooh. You see that, baby? Yes. Hello. Gifts from the universe. You got Pentacles written all over this reading. So some of you guys are taking on brand new money, new finances, love. Something great, stable is coming your way and it's going to be a complete game changer for you. Page of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. Empress. Wow, I don't know what else to tell you. The Nine of Pentacles, like, this is amazing. Capricorn, this is awesome. And that Ace jumped out there. Spirit's like, uh, take that. I sure will. <laughs> so Ace of Pentacles. Some of you guys are moving, getting a new house, a car. Some of you are on a definite, definite course. And, uh, oh my goodness, hello. Hello, another jumper, baby. <laughs> Go in for that one. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, clarify a nine of pentacles. That's what's up. You are so on your game. You are so getting to your money, getting to your coin. You're being noticed for that. This person sees you as somebody very abundant, somebody they can grow with, somebody they can build with. And you just had another card flip. I'm not going to turn it over yet. Keep seeing what spirit has for you. Any more messages for Capricorn? Any more messages for Capricorn? Your clarifiers are going amazing. I am totally legit over here. Like, damn, that's what's up, Capricorn. Okay, any more messages for Capricorn? Any more messages for my Capricorn for December 2019 spirit? Any more messages for Capricorn? With that Ace of Pentacles, though, I'm selling about that is literally a gift from the universe. Can you see that? And this one card here wants to come out, and I'm going to take it. It's in my hand like this. My thumb done clutched it. Ten of Cups. Ha, huh, Hello. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, someone is seeking emotional fulfillment with you. Seeing you as being someone that they can build a family with. The Ten of Cups is about emotional satisfaction and completion in um, areas of life, like something being complete. You're about to be emotionally fulfilled in ways that you could only possibly have dreamed about when you have your ace of pentacles with the ten of cups here so your love life is going to improve your finances are getting better like even if you're struggling right now if it don't seem like it like shit's about to get real for you capricorn shit's about to blow up and glow up in your life it's coming your way and it's faded i mean this is divine right here these messages i don't pick your cards i let spirit do it strength the one i hadn't flipped yet you could be dealing with the leo Strength here is about, um, with the imprints, you're giving birth to new strengths. You're giving birth to new ideas. You are so pregnant right now with ideas, with abundance, with the Ace of Pentacles. You know, you have a lot going on. You have a lot to look forward to in your life, in your experience. So that that you've been through, that that has come your way, that did not serve you well, uh, make some choices and cut things off from you know what it is for you you know spirit's not giving a whole lot of information up about that situation personally what it may be but you know what your situation is whatever you're going through right now it's like someone wants to come and apologize for it but um whatever you choose to do with that moving forward just know that these pentacles are like literally stalking you <laughs> you're gonna have opportunities coming out of woodwork at you and you have someone that's coming your way that's like really focusing on you really focus on themselves and their coins Pay attention for this person, man holding the coin, um, knight of pentacles. You got two men holding the coin, as a matter of fact, with that knight of pentacles on his horse holding his coin, as well as the man holding the coin on your oracle card. So this is someone that's financially set and stable, um, that wants to match your fly. They can be young right now. They can be younger than you. Maybe they don't have right now, but this is someone you can build with. Look to the future with this person. Look to the ace of pentacles manifestation coming to you and in your life and um three of wands you're waiting <laughs> right now you are at a point in the time of waiting things are being divinely timed in your life this may not be the time right now but it's coming your way capricorn any more messages for capricorn are there any more messages for capricorn for december 2019 spirit any more messages for capricorn do you have any more messages for the capricorns Any more messages for Capricorn? 
All right, I'm gonna pick. If the spirit doesn't give me a card, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna pick it for you. And then my message is for Capricorn for their December 2019 reading. My lovely, lovely, lovelies. Let's take you one more card here from the top, and then I'm gonna rock it out. Queen of Wands, your person sees you. This is fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Again, this person, woo, queens, queens, queens. This person sees you as very attractive. Nine of Pentacles and Queen of Wands. This lady is a head turner. Like I said, something about her style, something about your style. You turn heads when you come in the room. Your style, the way you carry yourself, the way you walk, the way you talk, you have your person wide open. This person wants to come to you and level up level you up add value to your life wants a happy family life with you someone who can see you as being the empress the mother of their children their wife someone that they want to give them babies someone that they see as just being the ultimate woman who can definitely bring value to their life as well um i'm going to get a romance angels card for you capricorns here I don't got excited <laughs> shit about y'all reading. I'm like, whoa, it's popping, baby. Yes, it is. So, yeah, Spirit, if you can, the Romance Angels, give me a card for it. We sign up Capricorn for December 2019. We would sure appreciate it over here. Spirit and me, 11 11. <laughs> I got two of them. This one, and then we have a jumper. This guy just flew on the floor. Let me get that. So, your jumper is Healing Family Issues. Okay, reflecting on that Ten of Cups. Um, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Some of you have mommy or daddy issues or is going through issues with your parents. So your love life heals. Um, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. I don't know if this is you or your person. Um, what I'm getting is that some of you are dealing with karmic family issues right now ten of cups is a completion so some of you have reached the ultimate level of a soul contract being fulfilled a karmic um contract being fulfilled maybe in another life you incarnated with one of your parents and you were the parent and they were the child so there was a lesson to be learned there and then some of that energy manifested and got carried over into this 3d physical experience and that could be causing a rift and a problem with you and your parent and it may be something that's beyond what you can conceptualize here in the 3d physical it's spiritual it's about the divine it's about source so when you forgive you can dissolve that karma karmic debt from past lives and begin to manifest begin to bring that pentacle energy into this life because that's your reward for having completed and fulfilled that soul contract and it takes for a really really open spiritual person to be able to even get that email me hit me up guys i would love to explain a lot more of this spirituality spirit and the universal energies and what's going on but some of you there's past life issues you were a parent to one of your parents in a past life and you had to resolve some karmic debt some animosity or some drama some of that shit can still be playing out right now you wonder why you don't get along with your parent or you have certain things feeling a certain type of way because you're not learning the lesson so it is what it is then we have you deserve love you are lovable of course you are that's what's up i will pull more cards i can do this shit for like the next hour but i'm gonna let you guys get on your way thank you so 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 much for joining your girl stardust 11 11 over here at spirit and me 11 11 i love you all so much have a great weekend my lovelies namaste <laughs>